Back at it with a brand new Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2 and Warzone 2.0 video here, guys. This is an important video that everyone's going to need to know. It's on the new Season 4 Reloaded patch notes, and I'll break down everything that just happened to the game. The patch notes were just released yesterday, July 24th. Right, we're going to start off with global right here, bug fixes. Fix an issue impacting some players receiving battle pass rewards correctly. Fix an issue where some players couldn't open the battle pass. Fix an issue where the player couldn't access division rewards in career and rewards in Warzone on rank play now it's time for the weapon balancing so the nerfs and buffs for assault rifles we got the latchman 556 maximum damage decrease mid far damage increase headshot multiplier decrease neck multiplier decrease and upper torso multiplier decrease onto the m4 upper torso multiplier decrease and lower torso multiplier decrease attack 56 got a headshot multiplier decrease now onto the tempest razorback minimum damage increase limb multiplier increase moving on to the battle rifles the chronos qual full auto maximum damage decrease close mid damage decrease damage step added at mid range minimum damage decrease headshot multiplier decrease moving on to handguns the basilisk found an issue with the akimbo snake shot basilisk where its damage profile was way higher than intended the FTAC Siege maximum damage decrease. X13s fix an issue that caused X13 autos damage profile to be higher than intended. Maximum damage decrease. Onto the shotgun guys, the new MX Guardian just got a nerf. Maximum damage decrease. Close mid damage decrease. Mid damage decrease. Mid far damage decrease. And minimum damage decrease. Damn yo, they nerf the hell out of this gun bro. You can't even use it anymore. Onto the SMGs, the ISO 45 fix an issue with the ISO 45 causing its upper right leg damage to be lower than intended so onto the weapon attachments guys for the ammunition for the kv broadside it's a 12 gauge dragon's breath close mid damage decrease onto the mx guardian 12 gauge dragon breath maximum damage decrease close mid damage decrease mid damage decrease maximum damage range increase close mid damage range increase mid damage range decrease and minimum damage range decrease guys this gun got fully nerfed to the fullest extent it's actually not even funny you can't even use this gun anymore no wonder i didn't have have fun and gameplay with it all right these are the bug fixes within the game fix an issue where snipers with high explosive rounds could be found on the ground loot in ranked play matches fix an issue where after the player's squad was eliminated the player left match and received the prompt to rejoin the match which is actually kind of weird fix an issue where players able to have infinite super jump by using a second tent v field upgrade fix an issue where equipping semi-auto trigger on mx guardian shotgun will cause the range to decrease several while fighting ai and dmz fix an issue where the squad loadout crate is missing the world icon until it's pinged and the last issue guys fix an issue that prevented players from being able to use the gulag token if they lost the gulag previously in the match hope you enjoyed that video guys this is pretty much the breakdown on the july 24th patch notes that just happened for modern warfare 2 and warzone 2.0 we'll be breaking down every single patch notes that comes to the game subscribe to my channel and like this video peace Got a bitch that worth a pole and she got her ass